name is Jeff Chinek from Morrison & Company. Most accountants can put debits and credits on a balance sheet or an income statement, but today I want to talk to you about what those amounts mean. Have you ever looked at an AR balance and wondered, okay, that's nice, what is it telling me? I want to talk to you today about accounts receivable turnover. It's an important financial ratio that, under, that will help you understand how quickly you're connect, collecting cash from your customers. It's a pretty simple ratio, requires a few calculations, and we'll go through one right now. AR turnover equals your net credit sales divided by your average AR. Normally, you do this for one year. You have your total annual net credit sales divided by your average AR for the entire year. Average AR is calculated as your beginning AR plus your ending AR divided by two. So if you had a, an, a calendar fiscal year, you take your January 1st AR plus your December 31st AR and divide by two. Pretty simple. Okay, let's go through an example. Suppose your net annual sales are $1.5 million. And suppose your beginning AR is $175,000. And your ending AR is $75,000. Your average here is one and a quarter or $125,000. $1.5 million divided by $125,000 equals 12. That means if this, if this was your company, your AR will be turning over 12 times during the year.